What's going on, natural bodybuilding? Vicar Bikini fans, Mike here with Inside Natural Bodybuilding at the conclusion of the Pro Female Bodybuilders here at the IFK Pro North American in Bloomington, Minnesota. Aaron College was putting on a top caliber show. 300 entries in this show breaks another record. Last year was 260. That broke a record. He just broke another record this year. So props to Aaron for putting on a great show here in Minnesota. I'm standing here. Oh, <laughs> got my deal. And uh, the pro females just got off the class here, so I'm standing here at the top. Female pro bodybuilder here, Donna. What's your last name? Donna Randall. Donna Randall. Yeah. Okay, now when you first came out on the stage, Donna Randall, I knew you'd be tough to beat, then I compared you with the class. I actually got the video of pre judging for the pro female bodybuilders on YouTube, so check it out and you'll see what I'm talking about. I was 20 rows back, looking through the lens of my camera, but I had you in first place. I went to the front row for a little bit. I'm like, okay, that's the girl right there. And I was so certain about it that I came to get you for an interview before the class went out, because I knew I wanted to interview you later on. Uh, you know, not that age makes a huge difference in these things, but well, maybe it does, but you're 59 years old and you're hanging with girls that are half your age, and it just goes to show that when you stay natural, that you actually hit your peak later on down the years. A lot of these females that win these shows, and even guys, are in their 40s winning these shows, because when you're not on steroids and you stay natural, typically hit your peak 42, 45 year olds is uh, the age that most people win these shows at. So you'll see Donna here is 59 years old and she's still in her prime. So we're gonna do some poses later on. But let's talk about pre-judging real quick and how that went. How confident were you? Because were you thinking of pre-judging that you'd probably win or what were you thinking when pre-judging was taking place? Well, I came out, I was the last person on the stage. So I was at the tail end and yeah. then they pretty quickly moved me to the center. So I knew that I was a contender. That's yeah. typically a sign that they're really paying attention to Sure, you. yeah. And when I left the stage, I thought it was mine. Yeah. I went home and took a nap and I <laughs> came back just yeah. to have fun and, and get the first place. And so did I. I would say legs win shows. You had the legs, you had the hamstrings to match. You even had a little split hamstring in the back. And a lot of females, a lot of competitors, period, don't have that split hamstring in the back. So I thought that show was yours as well. You had the symmetry from down top and bottom. Uh, how about how many years you were competing for? I started bodybuilding. Well, I went to the gym for the first time at age 50. Okay. I had my 50th birthday and had some belly rolls and thought, oh, I can't wow. keep doing this. Went to Lifetime, said I need a trainer because I didn't want to get hurt. Yeah. And started working out. And a year after working with the trainer, once a week I would meet with him. People started to ask me what I was getting ready for. Yeah. And I was yeah. like, my ears perked up. Ready? Yeah, yeah, getting yeah. Ready yeah. For something? So you didn't even start until you were 50. So you're never. It's never too late to start. You know, even if you're 40, you know, you. It's never too late to start. She was 50, and not only did she start when she was 50, but she's also competing at 59, taking second place at a top pro female bodybuilding show. So that's huge. That's some inspiration right there. So you started competing. Uh, how many shows have you done to this point? I have done, I think, four or five uh, an AMDF, and then now the pro show. Okay. My first show was in Des Moines, and then I did Callister show, and those were both in 2007 or 8, I yeah. think. Okay. And then I got my pro card 2012, and now this pro show. And you are. Well, good. Well, you're definitely qualified for the Orton Cup, the nation's biggest natural female bodybuilding show out there. Do you think you're going to possibly do the Orton Cup this year? i got to take a look at my schedule. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Yeah, yeah. we'll go ahead and get some poses. Here's what the top female pro looks like here in the IFPA. 59 years old, but man, she's really hanging with all the top pros here. Do a quarter turn to the right. Good thighs there, too. Specializing legs. Good stuff. And quarter turn to the right. This is Donna Randall here. Look for her and look for the pre-judging video. Good back, Donna. Good back, court from the right. Definitely got good genetics. Were you an athlete back in the day, like before you started competing? I did a uh, little gymnastics in high school. Quarter turn to the right. Yeah, gymnastics always helps out. Well, there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Inside Natural Bodybuilding. This is Mike Newman. This is Donna Randall, Inside Natural Bodybuilding. Thanks for watching.